Hey kids, okay, I'm here with another review, and this is also going to be um, Cheapskate Alert. That's what I'm going to call them. It's my new series. It's called Cheapskate Alert, and it's basically going to be um, videos where I uh, alert you guys, my viewers, which isn't very many of you, but hopefully it gets more, that about something cheap that can be used for makeup purposes or something that's makeup related that is really cheap and that I think is a great buy. So this is going to be my first cheap, <laughs> cheap skate alert, and so um, let's get started. So my first cheap skate alert is um, actually from the 99 cent store, which is amazing because usually when you think 99 cent store, you think like cheapy little plastic stuff and everything else. But the other day I was in there and they had a whole makeup aisle, and it was really interesting. Some of their stuff I'm not going to touch. Um, their eye pencils I'm not going to really touch because. I'm really fond of my CoverGirl eye pencil for one, and two, they're not uh, optometrist, uh, whatever, the eye doctor approved, so you can't put them on your waterline, and that's where I like to put my eyeliner, I really don't like putting it in my lashes, because it just looks weird to me, so I don't like doing it. Anyways, um, the eyeshadows. For a dollar, I'm pretty sure even with my eyeshadow primer, they're going to be creasing and falling off really quickly. So I decided not to get that. Um, I also got a liquid eyeliner along with the lip glosses, but I can't find the liquid eyeliner. And it what and so I don't have it. Anyways, so I did buy a liquid eyeliner and I did buy some lip glosses and a lipstick. The lipstick wasn't very good. I'll put that in a different review. But this is just for the lip glosses. The lip glosses were pretty amazing. Um... I got three different lip glosses. I got this pink one, if you can see that, and I got this really dark purpley one, browny one, I don't know, brownish one. Um, they were a dollar each, which is remarkable to me that these lip glosses were a dollar each. Um, they smell sort of vanilla-y. They have, I guess I should they have a doe foot, so that's how they're applied. Um, the colors that I got for these, this is the pink one right here, Then this one is the brownish one, and that's that. With these, I will say that they did go on really well, and they did do shimmer. These are the shimmer lip glosses, and uh, they did do shimmer. They were really good on my lips. Um, they don't taste good at all. They don't really have a taste, and that really bugs me that they don't have a taste, but I can't really complain because they were only a dollar. Um, but the pigment of these are amazing. You can put them on yourself, or on by themselves, and it's amazing. Uh, they do, when they start getting dry, they do get a little grainy, and um, that's about it. But, cheapskate alert, if you need lip gloss and you don't have the money for it, these are amazing. Um, and, they work. They work. They're amazing and everything else. I also got their uh, shiny lip gloss and that it comes in these tubes. There's more lip gloss in this than there is in the other one. I didn't like these. They were way too sticky for me. I didn't like these. They were way too sticky for me and it looks really pigmented in the little jar but they were ridiculously not pigmented. This is a huge glob because I couldn't get it to show it with just this little smear like the other two. These other two are just little smears. This one's a huge ass glob that hasn't dried yet and you can barely see the color on it. So I didn't really like this and I didn't feel bad because it was only a dollar like I said. So Cheap Skate Alert, I think you guys should go check out these lip glosses. I give them um, a four. I'm going to say a four. They're really good lip glosses for their price. They only do get a uh, little grainy when they start drying, and they don't taste good. But they smell amazing. They smell better than a lot of the other lip glosses that I've ever tried. So I really like them. They weren't gobby and everything else. So I hope you guys like this cheap seed alert, and I'll have some more later on for you guys. Um, and please rate, subscribe and review or comment below telling me what you guys think and if you think I should do more of these. Okay, well, I hope you guys have a good day. Bye.